So, this whole bashing of traditional marriage by gay marriage supporters is a bad way of going about getting equal rights. Everyone should have rights. Don't get me wrong. Everyone should have the right to marry who they want to marry and date who they want to date without worrying about getting bullied or put down or disrespected. I mean, think about it. We got through so much already. We got through African American rights and women's rights and freedom of religion, which, without which, by the way, all you people in churches going about preaching that gays are an abomination, without that right, you would not legally be allowed to do that. Just, just remember that. And remember that this is America, and we have the rights to our bodies, minds, and souls, and we should live together in peace and harmony. Everyone has the right to live in peace and harmony with the world, whether you're gay or straight or bi, or Jewish, or Christian, or Muslim, or a woman, or a man, or an intersex person, or blonde, or a redhead, or you have black hair, or you're raised by a single parent, or you're raised by two parents, or you have no siblings, or you have many siblings, or maybe you have half siblings, or you're in the military, or you drink, or you do drugs, or you're goth, or a valley girl, or you just like to run, or just to name a few conditions. You can't, you can't do whatever you want. You can't bash people for who they are. But you can be you. You can be whatever you want. That's why you exist. You're the only one who, who is you. You're the only one. And whether you're one or two or five or none of the things I just, I just listed, you are special. And you deserve to be treated with respect. And so does everyone else. So let's just let's just come together for each other and for our country and for the world and for the children, as they all say. <laughs>